If your Epson L6580 printer displays the device recovery mode update firmware message after turning it on, this video is for you. If you're having trouble with your printer, you can fix it for free on your own. If you have any technical questions or aren't sure which printer to buy, just ask us for expert advice and free support. As you can see, the error shows you need to update the printer's firmware. First, you need to download the firmware for this printer from the official Epson website. Now, go to Google and search for Epson L6580 firmware. Open the first website. Scroll down and open the firmware option, then click on download to get the printer firmware. Now, wait for the firmware file to download. And now, open the downloaded file. Now let's go through the seven steps of firmware updating together. Step one, select the next option. Step two, choose the agree option, then click on next. Step four, click on next. In step five, the USB cable must be connected between the computer and the printer so that the printer is recognized here. Then click on the USB option and press next. Now click on the yes option. Now, after completing all the steps, click on the Finish option and the program will close. However, do not turn off the printer. Now, wait for about five to 10 minutes until the printer turns off automatically. Be careful not to turn off the printer manually and ensure that the power is not interrupted.
As you can see, after five minutes, the printer turned off automatically. Now, turn the printer on. And that's it. The printer is now fully fixed and working smoothly again. By following these simple steps, you've successfully updated the firmware, resolving the issue. If this video helped you out, make sure to give it a like, share it with others who might find it useful, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and tutorials. Your support means a lot to us. Thanks for watching.